painting. We uh, did you tell people what we were doing with it? We we rent. No, 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 no. We don't use the hammer on the side of the car. Things you never thought you'd have to tell your children. Boy, 101. Uh... <laughs> I just got it. <laughs> Can we say that again? <laughs> oh my gosh, yo! Oh my gosh! That was literally the best. Are we over here? Oh, we're over here. Peace! I correct myself up sometimes. Oh, oh cool, we're right here. We like right here! What a champ! I can't let people give up Keep going, Kelly. <laughs> Alright, so today I'm gonna be replacing this Jeep top um, because as you can see, it's kind of torn, and then I rented it out on Turo. And the back frame of it kind of got a little bent. That's what this ratchet strap is holding down. So I need to try to tweak it back if I can and then put the new top on. So this is also an LED light that is a fog light that I found um, while I was working for a tow company and I wired it up to be part of a dome light. So yeah, and the boys are with us so it'll be really fun. Huh? Uh, I don't know. I gotta look at it first. Ooh, what happened here? I didn't even notice that. Anyway. And then the other thing is this, the zipper here completely ripped off. So, um, yeah, the boys are gonna be helping me film. And there's pretty Aaron over there. <laughs> Being a goofball as usual. Here's the old Jeep top. The tape. The tape. <laughs> <laughs> That's the new Jeep top behind Aaron. Yeah, we're just gonna stretch you out over the top of it. I'm wide you're like you're like um the Incredibles mom, right? Stretch Armstrong. Stretch Armstrong. So that's a new one. I've kind of I don't know. It's kind of all messed up. There's Maxwell. So I had to straighten some of these struts, like the one that he's holding on to was bent way down there and I kind of just bent it back with this yeah, ratchet so strap. That's my that's the that's my dad's axe that he that he picked out of the garden. He uh yeah he actually shined it up and it wasn't rusted and it was super shiny before it was it's left just, in a garage by my mom. And we just randomly leave it in the Jeep in case of emergency, you know. No, it just didn't go to storage yet. <laughs> so that's well, how I'm so I have this anchored below here. And um, it's just kind of hooked on the top here. And I was trying to, you can kind of see how it's like straightening it with that one over there. Did you tell them what happened? Who, your dad? Yeah. Yeah. Can you tell YouTube what happened? Do you want to tell YouTube what happened? <laughs> Kevin Reynolds. Do you want to tell how it first happened? Well, this little guy that's about five inches long came from me. <laughs> I'm not proud of it, but we have, like, go. We have an overhang that like goes over the top of the garage in the back of our house it's how long is it it's like it's like a foot long it's like a foot long i don't know that overhangs like a foot long no it's bigger than a foot it's like is it okay kevin says it's like three feet long and i was driving and i didn't brake soon enough and slid and it just ripped like a five six inch hole in the top of the jeep kevin actually was surprisingly calm and was not mad at me but it's been like this for what two months babe uh -huh. it's been like this for like two months ish and then yeah. kevin just ordered a new one which is this one because so we we were rent a while we'll rent out the jeep and rent out uh the lexus so if you want to rental code to get like a cheap car rental when you're in chicago this guy can help you um but we rented it to someone and the guy um 
forgot to put like the latches down in in the front of the car so like under the visors there's these like hooks that you latch the hood or the top of the jeep to to keep the top secure and i was following him in our other car and as i was following him the entire top just flung off and bent to the side and i guess the guy forgot to latch it so it bent what is that part called the frame i guess of the top um, the frame just was bent and janky and not good. <laughs> and so Kevin went out and bought a new top and now is kind of trying to hammer the, the frame back into place so that it moves properly. Because show us what this bottom one does. This bottom piece, I don't think was touched, but I think it was just... The... This one just goes up like this. So that one was fine, but this top piece was the one that... They make Bent a fastback one that goes on this and it just goes down here. But I think it uses a different frame or something. Yeah, so the entire frame was just pushed off. Was it, did we establish to the left, I think it was? It just bent. It pushed off that way. Oh, okay, so it pushed off to the right and it was just like flopping in the wind. So today's project includes installing a new top, whoop, that thing, and bending the frame back to a normal ish state. So that's the nutshell, long nutshell version. <laughs> um, Kevin, so far, you wanna tell us what these screws are? Those are all the screws that hold on the Jeep in these little holes right here. The so the fabric holes. just kind of curls around it and then it screws onto it and there's those and then there's these and then there's other ones in the front. So these are all screws from multiple parts of the frame. But just watch the time lapse, it's about to happen. And Kevin will show you how to do in case you ever come into an unfortunate situation. I'll show you guys how to take it off because I was kind of stupid when I was. today fam we have these. this lady on <laughs> kelly's like i'm out <laughs> Why? facebook gave us a bunch of hamster stuff for free Why? yeah Why? you guys excited oh look at this 
Got some scrubbing wipes. Oh, we got a this? whole. We got like candy for the hamster. This is like um, so that you don't have seeds. to touch her bedding anymore. There's like yogurt bites, which I think are those. Yogurt bites are where you get babies, though. I'm kind of concerned. Whoa, this is so huge, like, guys. Yeah, it's so huge, right? Yeah, I still don't know what this is. It's got this like a little button in the bottom. I think it attaches to the cage, and it's just for her to hang out inside. But she can't like get up in here. See this? I don't we get it. It's like, a it's like a water ball or something. She poops in the ball all the time and breaks them, so we got another, we got another Now one. we have three balls. No. Three balls. With three balls in it. We have, Look at this is like, this. I like this. This is pretty cool. It's like, like it's like a little thing. You like open this it's and then dead. it like pops open and then it's she can like come den, out. Though. Hamster den. We got these treats. They're baked. With Where's all the big tubes at though? You said you got big tubes? Oh, okay. That one. No. That one. Oh, well, there's so many boxes. Oh, shoot. Dang it. Seriously? Um, oh, my God. I should not put it all up here. Hey, game over. Do you want to move this first? Yeah. Move this. Thanks. I got it. Some coffee well, now you got spills. a hot three and three. Yeah. Frick. <laughs> Hamster perfume women. Do that again. Do that again. Show everybody how it works. <laughs> Christmas <laughs> ornament. Yeah, it does. It looks just like that. This is my perfume holder. Why does this look like there's nothing underneath here? Because oh, but there's everything. There's here. not. <laughs> Be careful. I that bedding, Sorry, I guess it's okay. Right. <laughs> it might be uh, sleeping permanently. I what? Seen, I haven't seen her at all. In I haven't heard days. her at all. Uh oh. Did Can we chat? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> my dear. Oh, baby. Oh, my dear. Baby, she's she's gone. No. Oh, my dear. I'm so sorry, I'm Okay.